I'm just heading down along the Jurassic Coast, fossil finding today. It's been a really good Easter week in Lyme Regis, lots of people down fossil collecting, so I'm going to head out through to the east and try and come up with some of the ammonites that people haven't been finding. They've said in the shop to me that they haven't been spotting some of the pyrite ammonites, so I'm going to try and head along the coast and uh, pick up a few uh, this evening with the low tide. So uh, let's see if I can find some. Other people have said they haven't found them and a few people have come in with some lovely little perfect pyrite ammonites from the Jurassic Age. So uh, head along the coast with me and I'll have a look for some fossils. I'm just heading down from the Charmouth Road car park and I'm going to go and fossil collect along the Jurassic Coast. I'm going to follow these steps down, down towards the beach and uh, see what I can pick up. I'm just going to walk along here and have a look for fossils in amongst the rocks on the 2008 landslide and uh, see what I can find in amongst the iron pyrites patches on the beach and uh, the evening's starting to close in the light's starting to draw in a bit but I uh, still got enough time to look for fossils as I go down here and uh, search sturdy gloves is uh, always a uh, thing to use on the Jurassic Coast looking in amongst the rocks for these fossil finds there's quite a bit of iron pyrites the fool's gold in these patches here on the beach this is heavy the ammonites are formed in iron pyrites they're heavy too and uh, so you're always looking in these concentrations for uh, such manner of uh, ammonites that get washed under the rocks to see doing the work for you washing them out of the mudslides and then they end up in amongst these sort of areas where you can fossil around looking in the iron pyrites. See if I can uh, get one out of this patch here on the beach. A lot of fool's gold here to look in. This is always a good sign where you see the fool's gold. Very small part of an ammonite there. Absolutely tiny fragment of an ammonite there from the Jurassic Coast. Keep looking. I've uh, found a few little bits and pieces this evening. A small piece of an ammonite there preserved in the iron pyrites. I want to try and find a whole one, but uh, look at these lovely little uh, pieces of the sea lily stem. The ossicles on top there, you can see lovely flowery sort of pattern and uh, a bigger piece there. And an oyster shell, one of the oyster shells from the Jurassic. Very water worn by the sea's actions and uh, it's uh, some of the fragmentary pieces that you find along this coast as you walk down. Well, the tide is on its way in now, well and truly on its way in. And uh, as I've come up along the beach, I found quite a nice pyrite ammonite piece, a little cluster of ammonites preserved in the fool's gold. As you can see here, I'll just bring it into focus and uh, a bit of pottery there saying lime on it. Uh, so there they all are, little ammonites preserved in that small piece of fool's gold. Different species of ammonites probably there. All preserved in iron pyrites. And then a very small one, I don't know if you can see that in the palm of my hand, a small ammonite there preserved in the fool's gold as well. Very, very small. So I'll take those back and uh, give them a soak when I get back home. So a lovely evening to behold here on the Jurassic Coast. There is a collecting code of conduct along this section of the area of the Jurassic Coast. And you need to look that up online, the fossil collecting code of conduct. That's a really good way of abiding by the fossil collecting ways along this particular part of Lion Bay. And uh, you can see that online if you look at the Jurassic Coast collecting, the Jurassic Coast fossil collecting code of conduct. 
So I'll head home now. The sea's on its way in, as I said. Please don't forget to subscribe to this channel, Brandon Lennon channel. Uh, you can see the little red button for subscribing to our YouTube videos. And uh, you'll see more ways of collecting ammonites along the Jurassic coast with us. Thank you.